Steve and I will be doing buttermilk pancakes, which we have a lot of, so please come down and get yours while the supply lasts. Um, we have directions are easy. Um, just mix the content of the pouch with two and one fourth cups of water and or milk. Mix the batter on low until smooth, um, about one minute. Do not over mix. For best results, let batter rest before cooking while you're getting everything together. Steve, we should be doing this. Also, let's see, uh, refrigerate unused portions. There you go. The griddle should be at about 400 Fahrenheit. Uh, all right, so that's the directions. Let's get the cooking. That's all you will need in the water and or milk. All right. Ready? Yeah, are we ready? Alright, so. Alright, so this is all you need. A spatula, some knife, some butter. We're gonna get the butter going. And while yeah. while we okay. mix that, um, we're gonna get this going. Again, we have a non-stick pan. So we're gonna use a lot of butter. Most important thing about making pancakes, follow the directions. That's all our right. cup. Two so we need two of them. these. Two and a quarter. Two if, and a quarter. If we follow the directions. We're going to follow these directions. All right. And while Jeanette is getting ready to mix up pancakes, I actually have a very interesting story about pancakes, as you might expect. Turns out, pancakes are actually named after the famous Portuguese explorer, Pablo Pancake. Really? <laughs> no, I just made that up. Oh. In. Mix. All right. Go ahead. Oh, you done? Yeah, that was my story. Oh, <laughs> that was really a story as a lady. <laughs> okay, okay, so. All right. While the griddle is getting warm, which is a pan with gas or electric um, heating source, he is mixing. You can use a mixer too. Can't you? True. Yeah, on low. That's right. So while he's being my mixer, what else can we use? Look at that. All right. That's it. This is as easy as pancakes get. You know what? I found a quick, uh, a neat trick. Okay. If you rinse a ketchup bottle after it's um, gone, you can fill it up with your mixture and you can put it, um, use it to a, to use it's a squirt. It's a squirt. Yeah. That's yeah. fascinating. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> this is both clean and important. So right. here we go. Now, thing about pancakes is almost always the first one doesn't go as well as you would like it to go. The second one always goes better. But we're going to do a couple here. Put them in the butter and let them cook. Pancakes are not hard. And then you would need a handy dandy spatula. This is it, folks. Please keep those requests coming in. We love them. So, is there any kind of trick that you can do to keep it from breaking? Or, I mean, how do you know it's ready to be flipped? We're going to watch it bubble. Okay. So. When it starts okay. bubbling, that's your indication that it's ready to be flipped. It's getting there. It's getting there. We want to see it bubble across the entire surface. All right. All right. This is not difficult, folks. Just be careful. Uh, it is hot. Safety first. Flip. That. No perfect pancake allowed, I guess. Get the butter around there. Look, it's no harder than that. Almost everything that we're trying to make here in the kitchen is to show you simple and easy ways to create food, cook food at your house that is both nutritious filling and easy to do. We're going to add a little bit more butter. 
just because that's kind of what we do. Is it because it's sticky? Is that why you're adding the butter? Yeah. Why it's sticky. And remember, first pancake, until you get the temperature just right. All right, while Steve is doing that, we have some toppings. Of course, you can always add fruit toppings to your pancakes and also a little bit of powdered sugar. There's, you can add apples, um, peaches, whatever, blueberries. And then, of course, your good old um, maple syrup. I like to warm my maple syrup in the microwave for a minute so that way it comes out nice and warm. Also, good old pe uh, peanut butter. So, whatever you desire. Go ahead and add it. Trial by error. All right. So, pancakes. I guess we'll add the good old maple syrup. And then we repeat. Don't have to see. Hope you're hungry. Once again, you can come down to the clubhouse, call first, and we have these packages that will be ready for you. Also, we have some syrup and some blueberries. So, bye, have a good day. Steve, you wanna say bye? Bye.